Well, hello, Grace Bible Church. We are three weeks into being able to gather physically together again, and it has been so sweet to get to fellowship and worship with so many of you. This last week was especially encouraging being able to be together, so many of us in one service centered around God's word and truth and song and worship. So grateful for that. And on behalf of the elders, I want to commend you on some things and encourage you uh, on a few others. First of all, thank you. Thank you so much for the way, many ways that you have all shown love for one another. Uh, from mask usage where possible, to appropriate fellowship and social distancing, to keeping hallways clear for those to come and go within the church. Even this last week as we met in one service and still have limited chairs and seating capacity, uh, the way that you intentionally came and sought to sit in a section that fit the size of your family uh, was just a blessing. We had so many able to be in the worship center because of that careful consideration. And we are so grateful for the ways that you as a body love each other so well. There's so many additional ways uh, that we see and many I know that we don't see in the ways that you care and love each other uh, in an exemplary fashion. One thing I want to encourage our body towards is to continue in this to excel still more. As we meet more frequently together, there's going to be a temptation to feel as if things are going back to normal. And we long for that day, but they're not there yet. And so one of the areas that we can continue to show particular consideration for one another is in mask usage. Uh, for those who can, where it's appropriate, I want to encourage you to continue in that. While many are coming and feeling comfortable interacting without them, before service, after service, uh, things like that, there's many in our body who are still particularly vulnerable. And the point of mask usage is not necessarily to protect yourself, but to protect others from yourself. So we want to encourage you, don't grow weary in this. Uh, don't grow overly comfortable too quick. There are some who wouldn't be able to or wouldn't feel it appropriate to join us on Sundays if we just disregarded those. And so a simple way that we can continue in love, again, as we can, is in mask usage. And that's still been the encouragement from our governing authorities to wear those as we gather. And uh, that's our encouragement to you is where you can. Let's, let's continue in that. Also, as more people start coming back to church, uh, there's less seating in the worship center in light of our social distancing practices. And so to continue to come early and find seats appropriate to the size of our seating party is going to be a great benefit to our body as a whole. So uh, I encourage you to do that. We'll also continue to have overflow available for uh, those who can't find seating. And we encourage you to come and, and utilize uh, those spaces and those opportunities. Your elders are so grateful to get to shepherd this body. It is a privilege and a joy. We're grateful for you. And we are so grateful that we can join together again. For those of you that aren't able to yet, we love you. We miss you. Uh, we hope that you are staying connected to the body in any way that we can be an encouragement or help or blessing. We want to hear that from you. Have a great rest of your week. Look forward to seeing and worshiping with you on Sunday. God bless.